Welcome back to the channel. Today's video is such an exciting video. I don't know if you guys can tell how happy I am. I just got sent over the potential winner for the Hawkeye STI giveaway. The reason I'm saying potential winner is I'm doing things a little bit unorthodox and that is because I am reaching out to the winner first to congratulate them to get their raw reaction for you guys as opposed to the sweepstakes company reaching out to validating them before I announce it. So I have to say potential winner because the sweepstakes company still has to validate them. I am so beyond excited guys. Being able to give someone a car is such a surreal feeling. It is going to be so cool. It'll even hit more once I fly out the winner to take delivery, stuff like that. That will be in this video as well. It'll have to cut obviously to that. But right now I'm gonna set you guys up on the tripod and go live on my social media account and call this potential winner. I don't know how we call. Where? Right there. First name, last name. Oh, what name. the fuck? Okay. Are you All right, I have the dude, him? huh? I'm gonna call him, right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna FaceTime you. Okay. This person isn't answering. Okay. Oh. They hung up. What's up, man? <laughs> Congratulations. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, I see. Sorry, I'm in the middle of doing a destiny raid. <laughs> Like, oh, what did you have? I'm curious. What did you buy? I didn't. I didn't do any research. As soon as I called you, I didn't even know your name when I called you. So I'm. What did you buy? Or did? I literally, bro. I literally bought a an air fresher because I. I <laughs> no fucking way. I saw one of your dude. I saw one of your reels and was like, oh, that looks sick, and I need a new air freshener. So fuck it. Well, boys, today is the day. In just a few hours, the winner of the 07 STI lands, and I am so beyond excited. I've been teasing with pictures and videos for the past couple weeks now, but today is the day he is going to be able to take delivery of this car in person. It is currently 10-ish, he lands at 2.30, but I am so beyond excited to get his reaction that he now owns this car. Now that I'm thinking about this, I left the title at home. So before I pick him up, I do need to go ahead and grab that title. But he is the new owner of this car. Before we go ahead and pick him up from the airport, there's one thing I wanna do, two things I wanna do on this car. One is do a refresh oil change. This oil only has like a couple hundred miles on it. But I want him to get this car with everything fresh. Um, and then also we do need to go ahead, go to the gas station and get this thing full. It is very, very empty. I don't want to hand him the keys to a car that has no fuel in it, um, especially because he doesn't know this area well with all the gas stations. And then to spice things up a little bit today, I'm curious what the fastest car he's ever been in. I'm not sure, maybe he's been in some crazy cars before, but I do want to go ahead and give him a ride along in Bose Evo 8. Makes 800 wheel. If you guys have watched the previous videos, we just got this car running properly back on the road. So that should be fun. Hopefully we get a good reaction out of that. Just kind of spice up the day a little bit. And then we're gonna go ahead and just drive these cars around town, show him a few cool scenic scenes. And then I'm not quite sure how he's feeling. He, I know he left at like 2 a.m. this morning. So he's probably gonna be pretty tired, but I'm excited guys. I am going to miss this car so much but thankfully as you guys know we have another one sitting back in the corner of the shop here that we are doing a full build on i'm still waiting on some more parts to come in but that should be a fun build so at least we have another 07 sti that we can drive around and a little bit more fun than just a stock daily friendly car you guys know me i like my cars with a little bit of power so that is what we have going on with this one let's go ahead and get things started off with a nice little quick oil change on this sti another reason why i want to do an oil change as well is i want to use a new tool that i picked up that i've been dying to use i was going to use it on this car but i'm waiting on parts and it's taking so damn long and i'm quite impatient and i don't want to wait that long to be able to use it on this car 
What I'm talking about is this fancy oil funnel. We got the car back on the ground with a new filter, oil drain. In case you guys are curious, this is the oil filter I use. It has a horsepower rating of 1,008. Now for the part I'm very excited for is I can finally now unbox my fancy oil funnel. Now you guys might be wondering what's so cool about an oil funnel? And I'll show you guys. So here we go, we have the oil cap removed. But with this fancy oil funnel, it screws on. And this now makes it a spill-free funnel. And there we go, guys. All right, right now we are heading over to Walmart. I'm trying to find like a car cover, like a black silk car cover. I have not been able to find one. So what I'm gonna do is buy like two king size black sheets so I can cover the car. So when I unveil the car to him, I can pull it off and boom, here's your new car. I think that might be cool. Maybe a little cliche, but I think it'd be cool. And there we go, we were able to make two king size sheets kind of work, the side of the car isn't really covered, but the general idea is there. I'm so pumped. I did also include some extra goodies, some t-shirts, a hoodie, some air fresheners because I have them in stock and he won the damn car. Well guys, he just landed. I'm pulling up, I'm like 30 seconds away. This man has been traveling 12 hours today. He left at like 3 a.m. our time, and it is 3 a.m., or not 3 a.m. right now, it's 3 p.m. right now. So this man, I'm sure, is quite exhausted. I'm gonna be throwing a camera in his face right away, but he should be pretty excited. All right, guys, well, we just made it back to the shop. I didn't want to throw a camera in Evan's face right at the airport, but here he is, guys. We just got to the shop. About to open up the shop door and show him his new vehicle. Oh, wait, the title. <laughs> I kind of blue balled you here. It's a little covered. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. And then also, here is some um, clothing. Hey, look, what won me the car. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I didn't tell you guys this yet. Um, what won him this car, a 2007 STI, was not this exact air freshener, but this air freshener. He spent $8, and he is now here in Spokane taking delivery of a 2007 STI. All right, are you ready? <laughs> Your new car. You want to start her up? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think the key should be in there. Okay, it's in the passenger seat. And it might be in gear, but probably. Oh, it's official. He just changed the seating position. <laughs> it is no longer oh. mine. <laughs> Very tame exhaust, but it's perfect. It's, oh, that's perfect. It is no longer my car, guys. This makes me so happy, but so sad. <laughs> what are your thoughts, man? I love it. <laughs> so in just a few minutes here, I think uh, he's pretty tired and hungry, which he's been traveling for 12 hours. So I think the game plan is, obviously he wants to go ahead and drive this car. I'll go ahead and for the first time ever, hop in the passenger seat of this car, drive it around, get his reaction, and then go get dinner, I think is the plan. But I know he wants a ride in this Evo here, so maybe we'll get a reaction with him in there, and then I think I'm gonna take the Evo out driving, he'll take this out driving, and we'll go cruise around town. We need gas. <laughs> oh shit, yeah, yeah, I, I was gonna fill it up, and then I thought maybe you wanted to be part of the filling up experience. Yeah. Obviously I'll pay for it, yeah. but your first fill up should be in Washington. Where do you wanna go? 
You wanna go get oh, it's not that There bad. you go. I've entered many. I've never won myself a car. Um, <laughs> oh. Giving her the bead. <laughs> so this is, there's kind of like a cool story behind this. This is not his first Subaru. Previously to this, oh, I didn't even know that. This is his third Subaru, I guess. Previous to this, um, if you guys watched the live stream, he had, was it a 17 WRX? Yeah. He had a 17 WRX that he sold to go to college and he was trying to get back into another Subaru and then he saw my page, saw the car giveaway and said, screw it, uh, left. left, screw it, I'm gonna enter and he bought an air freshener and he's now in Spokane driving his new STI. It's not that bad, you sold your car for college. Bought a GTI cash that was clapped out and had a lot of rust. And then you got rust. An STI for 12 bucks, right? <laughs> Something like that. Twelve dollars and forty-six cents. No. All right. Well, we just got back filling up the car. We're about ready to head over, get checked into the hotel, and get some food. But first, Bo gave me permission to give him a little ride along, nothing crazy as it is not my car, but he loves Evos, he wants a ride in this car, so that is what we're gonna do right now. Get his reaction. The fastest car he said he's ever been in is like 600 wheel, or claimed 600 wheels, so. This should be a fun ride, right? Ugh. This thing is gorgeous, though. <laughs> nah, this thing is fucking I saw this and I was like, damn, that shit is clean. That shit only has 55K. So, Remy is driving the car. I'm taking hold of the camera for a minute. I'm gonna hold on for dear life. And there we go, we just went up and down the street. Nothing too crazy, not my car. Uh, we did have the infamous I doing head unit shoot out on us. There's no screws that hold it in. Like on my VSTI, there's screws that hold it in. These are just clips. So we need to figure out a solution so that doesn't come flying out all the time. Bo warned me about that a while ago and there we go, tipping into second. Not even full throttle, like it wasn't even that crazy and it just shot right out, but. He finally got a nice ride. He's been wanting an Evo. He says this is going to be his next purchase, or at least hopeful next the purchase. Is They're very expensive. Stuck with me, yeah. <laughs> but there we go. Wanted to give him a ride in this car. Thank you, Bo, for letting me do that. Thanks, man. Really appreciate it. It's now time to go check in to his hotel. I'm not checking in. I. <laughs> that sounds weird. <laughs> um, we need to go get him checked into his hotel and then get some Chick Fil A. He does not have Chick Fil A where he is located. 
So I think that's the game plan here right now. Well, I just signed over the title. I no longer own two 07 STIs. I still own one though. Um, right now we're just heading over to the hotel to get them checked in and then we're gonna grab some Chick-fil-A. All right, it is now the next day, Evan's last day here in Spokane and the transport company just showed up to get this car transported all the way to New Hampshire. He was not wanting to drive this 3,000 miles, which makes complete sense. And Evan wanted to be here while it gets loaded up and then in a couple, or not a couple weeks, in like 10 days, this car will be showing up to his door. This is your last startup until this is at your home. Yeah, that's crazy. Awesome. Thank you. That's good. Perfect, man. This is officially the last time I will more than likely ever see this car again. It is all loaded up. He's just doing his inspection here. And in probably like 10 to 15 minutes, this car is leaving and going to his home state. A little of a bittersweet moment here. Um, yeah, I cannot be more excited. I could have not gone to a better person, so I'm very excited. He has quite a few plans for this car. He does want to keep this stock. He wants to do some, do some like suspension upgrades, stuff like that, but he wants this to be a pristine 07 and keep it that way. And there we go, the STI is officially gone. I no longer own it. It is going to the big hauler. They're making all their rounds, picking up all the cars and then taking it to their main hauler to do cross state travel, if that makes any sense. So there we go, the official winner and owner of the 07 STI. But we still have one more 07 STI in the collection here. And if you guys have been following along, we are stockpiling a ton of parts for an insane street build on this car. So stay tuned. I'm just waiting on the last few parts to show up and we can go ahead and transform this car. Transport came about six hours earlier than we thought they were coming. So we have a full day of time to kill. So we're gonna go get some breakfast and show them around Spokane. But also if you made it this far in the video, the VASTI might be running shortly.